Okay, here's our Make Ready tip for the day. These wall plates, uh, a lot of times they get painted over really bad. So what I like to do is take them and let them soak for about 15 minutes. Okay, as you can see, these are kind of nasty. Look how bad they are. But once they've soaked for 15 minutes, as you can see, a lot of it just peels right off. Okay, nothing to it. So, but it's very important that all face plates look new. Uh, it's one of the first things that people are going to notice. All right, just you take some steel wool, clean them right up. Like I said, about 15 minutes of soaking will take care of it. Okay, nothing to it. There's a, you know about eight seconds. This one here, we'll just time it. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, four one thousand, five one thousand, six one thousand, seven one thousand, eight one thousand, nine one thousand, ten one thousand. So, ten to twelve seconds each. So that means you could probably clean all of these in about five minutes, as long as they've been soaking in a little bit of water for. 15 to 20 minutes and make sure that you use good screws okay you, all, you always want the screws to look nice too all right that way uh, gives us a, a leg up on our competition uh, the market is so competitive nowadays that uh, even if everything isn't perfect in a particular unit it should at least look that way and that's about it for today Okay, we've spoken a number of times about how important it is for these plates to look good. Okay, because uh, mainly because they're eye level. You know, the any new resident who's touring a unit is going to be drawn to these. You can see how much nicer that's going to look once this all gets painted and everything. But now, anytime you have to replace one, for example, this one's broken. Keep the old screw. The new one that you get is going to come with a screw already in it. So you want, to, you want to keep the old screw, and what I like to do is just take a piece of cardboard and poke some holes in it. Uh, and now, anytime you resurface a cabinet like this one here, or a tub, there's usually a, just a little bit of paint left in here. This is the epoxy. You can also use uh, appliance uh, paint, appliance epoxy. Never, ever, 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 ever use kills. It's, uh, it, it's going to dry flat and it's also uh, real flaky. So as soon as you try to go put the screw in, it's just going to flake off and it's going to look just as bad as the old screw you started with. But you basically just take this, give it a couple of little shots. Do you see we've got some up here that we've already done? Anyway, it looks like brand new screws. Okay? And that's all you got to do. And that way uh, everything looks nice and consistent. And uh, you'll get it's a much better match. It's going to look good, great on the wall.